Hi and welcome to this DCP web tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to remove duplicates from a spreadsheet using LibreOffice Calc. So if I open up this folder, we've got this file in here called Client Data. It's saved as an open Office or LibreOffice file, ODS file extension, but you can also use this same process to open up and remove data from an Excel spreadsheet as well. So LibreOffice, you can use that software to open Excel spreadsheets as well as OpenOffice and LibreOffice documents. So when I double click on this file, it will open up and it will show the data in LibreOffice Calc. And I've simply got two columns in here. I've got first name and last name. But you could have more columns in here. You could have telephone, email, line address one, two, the city, the postcode, all of this data about these particular users, right? So this data might have been sent to you from one of your colleagues or Typical example where I see this being used is if you've got a form on your website. So imagine you've got some sort of data capture form and you're capturing lots of information, maybe for a competition or something like that. And then lots of people are filling out that form. And let's just say this person called Danny Gold filled out the form here, but then he also filled it out again here and also here. So Danny Gold is listed three times you can see in this spreadsheet. Imagine if you've got thousands of rows of data and you want to remove all the duplicates, you could go manually through this whole spreadsheet and remove them, but you'll be there for a very long time, right? So this goal of this tutorial is to show you how to do this quickly. So we'll click on first name here. We'll go to data. We'll go to more filters and then we'll go to advanced filters here. When we go to advanced filters, we need to click on the first cell. So we'll click on first name here. Make sure you click on this one here. So if you've got normally the first row uh, of data will be the headers, right? The titles. So we'll click first name here. I'm going to scroll down the spreadsheet. If you've got a lot of data, you may want to use the bar down here to scroll quicker. But I'll click on this first cell, scroll down the spreadsheet, and I want to click on this cell right here where it says gold. So I want to hold down the shift key and then left click. So that will highlight in blue, you can see this blue border around all of the data. And that's called the selection. So the selection is now done. I can go to option here. And then it says range containing column labels, right? So the first row is uh, the column labels, or we call them titles or whatever you want to call them. So this will always be default ticked off. You can't really unselect it because it knows that this, this is here is the titles. We, we, what we want to do is select no duplicates, no duplication here, and then simply click OK. And when we click OK, there's all of our data without duplicates. So I've got this sheet down here called client data or client data sent. I'm going to highlight this data here now with my mouse. I'll left click here and then hold down the left mouse button and drag and select all of this data. I'll press control C to copy and then I'll go to a new spreadsheet. So oops, I created too many. Let's delete. We only wanted one extra one. I'll just delete these ones. So I've got this sheet called sheet. We've got this new sheet called sheet two. I'm going to double click on it and say client data no duplications. So I'm going to name it client data no duplications and then I'm going to click on this first cell and press control V to paste. Now I've got a separate sheet with no duplications. I can go back to client data here, the client data sent sheet. And if I want to get back to my original data, Right now, there's a selection. You can see this little dotted line around the data here. You might just be able to see that. I'm going to press the escape key to remove that selection. I'll left click here, hold down the mouse button and select all of this data here from row 1 to 23 here, you see, right? And then I'll just right click and say show rows. Now I can see all of the data. So I've got two sheets now in effect. I've got one sheet that's the original data now. And I've got a separate sheet with no duplications. Now there's another slight different way of doing this. I'll show you again one more time. So I'm going to click on first name, go to data, more filters and advanced filters again. And I'll click here and then I'll just drag with my mouse all the way down and select all of this data. And then what I would do is go to options here and I'll say copy results to and then I'll click here in this this cell here F cell here and then I'll click OK. Now all that's done is basically 
taken this data and removed all the duplicates and put them here over here on this side so you can you can do some sort of comparison if this was more numerical data it might have been worth doing it this way so now you can see the data is pretty much the same but no duplicates here or you can do it the first way where you do the remove the duplicates and then copy it to a sp separate spreadsheet over here okay so that's how you go about removing duplicates from a LibreOffice Calc spreadsheet and you can use this same process to open up other files like OpenOffice spreadsheets or uh, Microsoft Excel. Okay, let's close this down. I hope you find that tutorial useful and I look forward to seeing you in the next DCP web tutorial.